Say hello to Mo Lester. Yes, these names are getting considerably worse. Mo is an incredibly skinny and useless man with absolutely zero stats whatsoever. He finds himself in the middle of an empty store wearing absolutely nothing whatsoever and in fact knows nothing about this location that he finds himself in. Unlike in my previous Zero to Hero videos, I will not be force feeding my character drugs. Mo is actually an addict himself, so he will be requesting them, just so I can have some sort of moral high ground. I think first and foremost, I need to find a pair of shoes. That would be quite nice. We have found some matches, a pen, and a magazine. Very nice. And we are not finding much else of anything. Let's have a little wander outside, shall we? Okay, it looks relatively quiet out here. We are seeing a truck over there. It would be quite nice if we could get our hands on that. Okay, there is a zombie coming towards us. Let's take care of you. If you're wondering how I can punch zombies in this game, that comes from the Brutal Handiwork mod, something I would highly recommend. If you're interested in what mods I use in my videos, I'll leave the entire mod list at the end of the video. Right, we're going to take your sneakers, we'll take your socks, you know what, we'll take your shirt. You know what, just to be a dick, I'm going to wear your silver ring as well. I'm going to put that on my left ring finger, pretend that somebody cares about me. Okay, I wonder what's going to be in here. Ooh, a hunting knife, we'll equip that primary. And there's a hammer that's in bad condition. Hey, we found a screwdriver already. This is a pretty good start. We found some more rings. Let's wear all of these as well. We'll put this one on our left middle finger. And a belly button ring. I mean, that sounds sanitary. We'll stick that on. Now, let's take this hammer. Okay, let's have a little drink out of this tap. Ooh, a Beavis and Butthead poster and a Bart Simpson poster. We'll take those. We'll put them up somewhere. Not to forget a garden wrench and some duct tape. Lovely stuff. Ooh, a crowbar. Get in. Put that on our back. We have had a pretty amazing start, although we are starting to get a slight heavy load. What a really Really cap off this start is if we can get ourselves that truck as well that'd be pretty perfect okay let's have a look at this truck what you got for me nothing in the back that's useful okay we've managed to get in oh, okay no good we found some bandages a pencil and a musketeer bar right let's uh let's hopefully not bump into many zombies around here i think we take care of this little one over here first Ooh, another ring. We'll wear this. Put this one on our right middle finger. God, we're going to be glammed up. Okay, I don't see any drugs in this bin. I'm hoping we are not going to get a repeat of my last few multiplayer videos where the drug mod did, didn't seem to work. Come on. Sneak on in, pal. Come on. Oh my god, you pathetic man. Oh, you suck. Watch this door be open. Okay, fantastic. Ooh, a fresh burger. Eat all of that, and we'll eat the fries as well. As we've spawned in at only 60 kg, it's important that we fill our face with as much food as possible. Also, by staying stuffed, it helps keep the heavy load down as well. Right, take this ketchup, fries, and burger. We'll munch all of that down later. Ooh, some acid. Let's just take this immediately. Okay, I took the acid, and there appears to be more acid, so we'll take it again. God, could you imagine waking up in the middle of nowhere in a zombie apocalypse, and your first thought is to drop two tabs of acid. All right, let's take a quick drink. Ooh, lemon lime bottle. Let's drink all of this immediately because then we can fill it with water and carry around a water bottle with us. Ooh, mountain dew can. We'll take that. That'll be good for giving us energy later on. Uh, heavy loads coming back on and we're no longer full. So I think we just down a whole bottle of ketchup. Why not? You got anything good back here? We have found some gravy mix. Let's just take all of that onto this little shack. What you got for me? Oh, it's just the toilet. Any drugs? Nope, no drugs. Kind of disappointed. Ooh, a bait shop. Now, let's actually try and get good at fishing with this character. Ooh, another Mountain Dew can. Hydration drinks. Okay, heavy load. Maybe we will not take all of this. I think we're in need of a bag very quickly, to be honest. Ooh, military sweater. Let's wear this. And some baggy jeans. Lovely. All right, we need to start dropping some stuff. I tell you what, let's eat this burger immediately. That'll help reduce some weight. There are two more vehicles we can check out here. That's promising. Open up the window. Climb on through. Ooh, fishing tackle and fishing net trap. I will come back for those in a moment. Okay, the fishing rod and fishing line. We'll take those. Oh, God, we're starting to get heavily encumbered again. Ah, this isn't good. Uh, what can I do to tackle that? I think maybe drink one of the Mountain Dews immediately. You know what? I'm going to drop the club hammer as well, just because it's not in the best condition. Ooh, worm. You know what? I'll eat this immediately. Um, we've somehow managed to find some helmets in a fishing store. That makes a lot of sense. I mean, I'm not one to uh, say no to a uh, nice little military helmet, so let's wear this. Okay, now I just look like Kanye West covering my face for no reason. Oh my god, there's more in here. 
This makes no sense. Let's just wear the vest, why not? Fishing tackle and line, take those. Right, drink the Mountain Dew and then we'll drop the bottle. And you know what? We'll have another one of the ketchups as well. Treat ourselves. And as much as I want this Bart Simpson and Be uh, Beavers and Butthead poster, I think I will put them up on the wall, you know, decorate the little tackle shop as a way of thanking them for uh, all the lovely loot that it's given us. There we go. I think they look nice in here. Now, now that I've got all this fishing stuff, I could really do with one of these vehicles. Oh my God, there is a key. Fantastic. Got no fuel in it. Okay, maybe... Maybe I can do something about this. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna lob a load of my stuff in the back of this car. Let me check the van first, just in case uh, there's a key for this, because I would prefer the van. Okay, the van seems to be locked, never mind. And I don't fancy smashing the window right now to bring over a load of zombies. Uh, right, open up the boot. Let's stick all of our fishing stuff in the back. We have a car, however, there are still a very good amount of zombies around here that we need to take care of. Let's uh, attempt to take them on, I say, maybe. Oh, there is a river up there as well. We can go fishing later. I think for right now, this first week, again, we need to go and watch some life and living. That is the best way to get our skills up right now. We'll let this little zombie come to us first. Ooh, we found some fingerless gloves. We'll take those. A pack of candy cigarettes. We'll happily take them as well. And not a lot else. Okay, go say hello to the other zombies that were down there. Okay, I think we take care of these three quickly. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's hope it doesn't get to be more than three. Okay, okay, there are more. Oh, fuck. Okay, yeah, there's a lot more. Ooh, gold necklace. Let's wear this. Found a lighter. Okay. Ooh, some more acid. We'll take that as well. A lot of big acid fans around here. Uh, where is that smashing noise coming from? Oh, from inside the shop. Hello. We found a classic wristwatch. We can now see what time we're on. Oh, it's 4.20. I mean, I'd love a little bit of weed right now. That'd be nice. But unfortunately, that means we've missed two Life and Living shows. That is really going to put a dent in the progress of our skills. I say we just get inside here and make sure that we don't miss the 6pm one. Oh, you're joking. There's no TV in here. Right, I'll try my best to loot this quickly and then move to next door. Dance magazine, I'll take you. Now, there is a zombie in here. Luckily, it is just the one. Oh, they've got some speed on them. Lovely. All right, there's another bin out here. Oh, no drugs. I guess I'm getting greedy. We found plenty so far. Oh, fuck. Hello. You might be wondering why I'm choosing to use a knife. Um, I am also wondering that as well. Why have I not switched to the crowbar? Oh, a Louisville map. Oh, fucking a zombie. Hello. Uh, before I was rudely interrupted, I was going to take these painkillers as well. Right, it's 10 to 6. I'm really hoping we don't miss uh, the next Life and Living show, but I have a feeling that we might. All right, come here, you bastard. Okay, our knife broke, so we've got to resort to the fist for now. Right, drop the useless knife and go straight for the crowbar. Hopefully we get in here with no problems whatsoever. I swear to God if there isn't a TV. Is there actually not? Oh, for fuck's sake, man. Okay, it looks like we're missing all of Life and Living for the first day. We'll take this emotional intelligence book for now. Uh, there's another one here. How to use Generators Magazine on day one. That is unreal. Uh, Mechanics Volume 1 as well. And another emotional intelligence book. Okay, it looks like tonight is just going to be very reading based. Uh, there is a page still here as tempting as that is i think i'll leave it for now a very nice room to stay in though i'm quite happy with that Ooh, a fedora that is tempting but we'd have to replace our mask and uh i quite like the kanye west mask that we've got going on Ooh, some antidepressants i'm definitely going to need those this game all right anything good in the kitchen eh, there's a good bit of food here Oh my god, there is plenty of food. Very nice. There is a manual meat grinder here. I've never used one of these. We can actually grind falafel. You know what? Let's grind all of it. Let's do some cooking. Right, I've made some falafel apparently. Uh, I'm just going to stick all of this in the oven for now. That is technically the oven. Did I just call this the oven? Okay, I've put all of that in the fridge for now. Uh, that is technically, I think, the first bit of cooking I've ever done in this game. God, I am shit at this game. Right, sit your ass down. I think we're going to power our way through these emotional intelligence books first. Uh, and then get the how to read generators magazine i always think we're going to read the how to use generators magazine straight away and of course prioritize the dance magazine uh, and then we will just power on with mechanics volume one god it's easy to forget how slow reading is in this game right i think that's enough reading for now i'm going to drop all of the books that we have read you know what let's treat yourself to some of that falafel 
falafel that we made earlier. In fact, I think I'm going to save the falafel for now. Uh, let's have some canned chili. We've got some more room in us. What else are we going to have? Let's have some canned spaghetti bolognese. Uh, you know what? Let's keep going. Let's have some canned peas. Now that we've put ourselves on the verge of a food coma, let's try and go to bed. Okay, we've woken up very stressed. That's not good. Seeing that we're up so early, we may as well check out the pickup truck that we saw outside. Got as happy as I would be with this, I'd already be annoyed to have to move over all the fishing stuff if we can actually get inside of this. There is some duct tape, I think I'll leave that for now. Okay, we also can't get inside of it and I am not ready to smash any windows just yet. All right, let's go next door. Oh, there is another car here. I kind of prefer our other car, but it'd be nice if you had some fuel in it. Okay, nothing useful in the bins. I love how I turn up at a house and the first thing I check is the bins. Oh, two more Louisville maps. That will help us learn a bit more of Louisville. I mean, obviously. All right, let's read all three of these, I think. Now, if we just span through them. Okay, so. Uh, two of those maps were the same, however, this now means that we have a good understanding of Louisville. Uh, we're actually quite close to Louisville as well. Oh, finally a TV. Again, getting my priorities straight during the zombie apocalypse. I'd want to watch television and do acid almost immediately. Okay, right, hopefully we can catch a little bit of the cook show. Typically, I think we're going to get our first full skill in cooking, despite my absolute reluctancy to cook. Oh my god, that is a lot of posters. You know what? I kind of want to decorate. Let's uh, let's put all of these up. I think every time I find some posters, I'm going to decorate each house that we go into, uh, just because, you know, keeps it nice and fresh for the next uh, zombie that breaks in here. I know, I'm so thoughtful thinking about the zombies and all again another priority during the zombie apocalypse just decorating random houses with posters uh let's not put the super mario one outside let's see why can't i put it on this section of the wall that's a bit annoying okay let's put it over the uh the light switch very nice i think this house is looking nice and cozy and with that we're up to level one in cooking very nice there's our first skill i think this is a cozy little base for now whilst we're uh, checking out the rest of this area we are up to level one sneaking as well. That does mean that there are zombies nearby. Right, is there any food? Oh my God, there is a car key here. So it turns out we now have the key for the car outside. Uh, I think for breakfast this morning, I'm gonna drink all of this almond milk. You know what? I think I want to officially make this our first little home. So let me mark it on the map. There we go. We've marked it down on our map. So we'll always remember this place. Right, I guess we check out the car that we've now got the key to. I should have checked the condition of the other car. However, I think I am gonna stick with the other car just because I prefer the the way that the other one looks however of course if this does have some gas in it i might have to take it okay it does have some gas in it we might use this car whilst we're exploring the area but ultimately i'll probably stick to the other car that we put the fishing rods in right do we go straight across the road or do we go next door more zombies over there than there is up there but i'm an idiot and i like to pick fights with too many zombies so i think i'm gonna go down here dude please we really need to get your strength up Oh, you suck. Oh, we're up to level one light-footed. Okay, I don't think any of these zombies have noticed us just yet. Oh, fuck's sake, we can't get in. Please, please, dude, just open the window. Oh, you suck so much. All right, pry open this window. Please don't let there be an alarm. Okay, I've managed to highly exert myself from that. So let's go back to this house and rest for a moment. I think whilst we rest up, I'm going to read a bit more of our mechanics book as well. So then we can drop it as soon as possible. Okay, we're no longer exerted, but I think I'm just going to keep reading till the carpentry show comes on. We may as well catch that now. Hell yeah, we are now catching the carpentry show as we are about to finish mechanics volume one. Oh, okay. He wants some more pills. Do I give him the acid or the painkillers? I think I'll give him the acid for now and we're going up to carpentry level one god what a good time this is taking acid and watching a carpentry show all right we're a little bit peckish let's just put our book away for now and then i say we uh we grab a little bite to eat why don't we see all of this eggplants why not see all of these frozen peas as well lovely right i think this time we head to the house opposite the road or oh, we might have to take on these zombies on the way because they are quite close two of them have noticed me already let's quickly take care of those Oh, a bag of cocaine. Quickly grab all of that. Okay, more zombies are coming. This has been totally worth it because we got some cocaine. Very nice. Oh, bucket of buttered theatre popcorn. Eat all of that immediately, straight from the corpse's body. A silver bangle as well. We're going to wear this. We're going to keep glamming ourselves up. Oh, another ruby ring. Let's wear this. Let's put this one on our right ring finger. God, we're going to be blinged out. Uh, we're going to take this animal print underwear as well. You know, just spice ourselves up a little bit more. Okay, can we sneak? Oh, okay. There's a fair few zombies by that door. Let's just try and sneak in here unnoticed. Oh, there is a zombie in here. Hello there. 
Ooh, a digital watch. We'll wear this. It's a bit of an upgrade. We're going to put the uh, old watch on the zombie. Nice little trade. Not like you uh, need the digital watch anymore. Mm, not really seeing anything of use in here. We are going to have all of this milk and all of this lettuce. You know what? We'll take the bottle of water with us as well. Right. Am I feeling brave? Hmm. Okay, have they noticed us? I think two have noticed us. Let's take care of them then. Come on, jump this fence. I dare you. I dare you. Come on, bring it. Okay, there are more coming. Let's just stay on this side of the gate for now. You know, don't want to have a fair fight or anything. That'd be too easy for them. <laughs> Oh, dude, please get up. Please get up. Like I said, it would have been an easy fight for them if we took them on normally. Alright, not really anything useful on them. We have yet another vehicle to check out here. Let's have a little look at you. How are you looking? Pretty damn fine, I'd say. And there is an empty gas can. Very nice. Take that. Now, this would be a perfect vehicle, but it's locked. Never mind. Alright, open the window. Please let me in. Yes, okay, finally. Uh, Warrior Freedom Trousers. We'll wear these. Okay, why not? Another dance magazine. Another dance magazine. This one for the African Rainbow. We'll read that immediately. God, we are getting a bit drowsy already. Another emotional intelligence book. Read that immediately, good sir. Plenty of canned goods here. Now... Do we have some of that now? I think so. I think we do. Let's have this fruit cocktail immediately. You know what? We'll open the carrots as well. All right, let's keep pushing around and exploring. I reckon we can fit some more stuff in before the next Life and Living show. Oh, hello. Let's take care of you guys. Oh my God. Come on, dude. Oh God, come on. We might be a bit too tired for this. Alright, take that back. Oh, a needle. Let's take that. Uh, no comment on what that's for. Oh, some crystal meth. We'll take that. Okay, farming volume one, metalwork volume one as well. We have to take both of those immediately, although we have got a bit of a heavy load now. A cocaine brick and a fanny pack. Hell yes. Freedom jacket. Wear this with a hood down. The cocaine brick. Can we put that in the fanny pack? No, we can't. Take the gin bottle. Uh, if you're wondering why I'm talking so fast, it's because I'm slightly panicked because we can hear a zombie nearby. Let's eat this bowl of whatever the fuck that is. All right, let me take care of you. Okay, we're getting a bit exerted and a bit tired, so let's have a bag of cocaine. And would you look at that, good as new. Tingles can eat all of this immediately. You know what, I think we should break up the cocaine brick. Let's open it up. All right, that gives us 20 bags of cocaine. Let's see how much we can put in the fanny pack. We can put 10 of it in there. That does help us, actually. Put some disinfectant, we'll take that. We are a dirty boy, after all. all. Right, I think that is enough exploring for us. Let's get ourselves straight back over to our house. All right, I think we, uh, we set out some of our drugs on the table. Let's put the needle down first. Okay, I put all of the drugs on the table. Oh, I think I put most of it on the floor. Never mind. You know what? Let's just pick all of this up. Oh, what's Dean going to teach us on exposure survival today? Bear with me, Dean. I'm just setting out my cocaine and meth. And you look at that. That's a fine little drug collection we have going on there. God, I hope no children watch my videos. Right, whilst we're catching this farming show, let's do... Oh, let's read farming volume one at the same time, just to get a little bit of a boost. Okay, I probably should have read that before. And you know what? I'm also going to put down the gas canister for now. Uh, we'll fill that up later. There's no need to carry it around. It's a bit of a waste. Okay, nice. I think it's time that we go to bed. Uh, we have woken up at 10 to 3. That's not exactly very good. And we're massively on edge. Maybe I will pop a painkiller. That might help us cheer cheer up a little bit. I know what else would cheer us up, but... Ah, no, don't worry. That's managed to help us a little bit. We've been reading for so long, the cook show's actually started. We haven't quite made its cooking level 2 after that. All right, we're done with the metal workbook. Very nice. You know what? We'll have a uh, pack of candy cigarettes as well. Let's just eat all of them. Why not? I love that he still sort of smokes when he takes them. I like to imagine he behaves like a five-year-old actually treating it like a real cigarette. Uh, there is a zombie outside. Let's take it. Oh, you motherfucker. Have you at least got anything good on you? Ooh, March Ridge map. We will take that off you once uh, we've stopped lagging and we take care of this zombie. Okay, my game has completely frozen on my screen. Right, take the March Ridge map. Okay, nice. We actually did get some good loot out of them. So let's read this map straight away. Ooh, how far away is March Ridge? Okay, it's very far away. Never mind. Okay, well, I worked out why my game started to lag. It's because my battery was about to die and I... <laughs> completely forgot to switch on my charger, so my bad. Right, we have explored a good amount of the local area. I mean, I do want to get inside next door, so I'm thinking maybe I do need to smash the window. Oh, hello there. How are you today? 
God, my uh, garden's starting to look a little bit cluttered now. Oh my God, you pathetic man, just break in. Oh, you suck so much. I'm risking my life to get in here. It better be worth it. Oh, it definitely is. There's a machete. Also a double barrel shotgun, but I'll have to resist that for now. Ooh, some food. We'll eat this. Very nice. Ooh, a pipe wrench. We'll take this as well. All right, because we've heavily exerted ourselves, uh, smashing that window, I think we need to very quickly push back to our house and just relax for a little bit. All right, let's get back on the ground and read a bit more of the farming book. This should take us up to the next carpentry show as well. Okay, it's time for woodcraft. Yeah, we've only got halfway through level one. That's not really ideal. Oh, shit. Okay, there is a zombie here. Let's hope they don't smash one of our windows. You are joking. You piece of shit. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Okay, so one of our windows has now been smashed. Great. Just great. I think it's probably not too sensible to keep this as our resting home now because I don't have anything to board that window up with. I think maybe we pop up the road slightly and go explore what the houses are like up there. Uh, saying that, we are now getting drowsy. Right, which drug should we take? Uh, have some cocaine. Hopefully this will wake us up a little bit. Could also do with some food soon. I think we're going to have to drop some of our items here just because we are carrying way too much at the minute. I think maybe we'll take this car with us. Hopefully we don't attract too many zombies. Okay, there are a fair few around here. No, maybe we could use this as a temporary base whilst we're uh, exploring the houses up here. Uh, not really seeing a lot of food here. Right, let's go check out next door. Ooh, some processed cheese. I'll eat all of that immediately. Oh, an ice cream sandwich. I'll eat that as well. Can open and some refried beans. Very nice. Take those. Oh, fuck me. That's a lot of zombies. Okay, okay. I'm going to try and be brave or stupid. I don't know the difference. Starting to think maybe this was stupid and not brave. Yep, very stupid. God, I'm missing the days where I used to play with Morty here. Jesus Christ, that was tense. Uh, there's a necklace with a crucifix here. I think we're going to need that. Oh, some heroin. It was all worth it. Another watch we can disassemble. Some cigarettes. Very nice. Well, at least we've cleared out the majority of the area around us. That's, I guess, a benefit. A riverside map and some more speed. Hell yes. Oh, some Xanax. Oh my God, we are finding the little crack den area. Right, I could do with getting inside pretty quickly. I don't want to catch a cold. Ooh, plenty of canned food. Let's take all of that. Like I'm just stress eating next to this zombie. Did you hear that? Of course you'd come over the second that I go to close the window. You know what, I'll take the watermelon with me for later. Ah, uh, maybe I can't. Let's, uh... Ooh, a backpack. Yes. Put that on my back immediately. We'll put the new hammer that we've just found in there, and I can stick my watermelon in there. Thank God. We found another crowbar. Stick that in the bag. There we go. Right. What else can we eat whilst we're here? Let's eat this fresh, uncooked Vienna sausage. Oh shit, I've just seen the time. We have an exposure survival show to catch. Let's very quickly head back to the previous house. Right, we are back just in time. What are you going to teach us today, Dean? Hell yeah, Dean's teaching us how to fish. That will come in handy with all the fishing stuff that we found earlier. Hell yeah, that is fishing level one. All right, let's go back out exploring. Found yet another screwdriver. Oh, another... Oh, we found a propane torch. We will take that. Okay, maybe we will not take that. Okay, we're too encumbered to take the propane torch, so we're going to have to leave that for now. I guess it's not really a priority at the moment using that. As a British person, I've only ever been to America once. I think I went to Florida when I was eight years old to go to, like, Disneyland. So... In the comments, I know a lot of my audience are from America. If you live in like a place like this, like let me know. I find this places like this really cool. And what's your life like in America? <laughs> Hopefully it's not filling your bins with crack, but I will be taking that. Ooh, good cooking magazine. We'll quickly read this and then we'll take Electrician Volume 1 as well. God, we're heavily encumbered again. Uh, let's eat all of this mustard and all of this ketchup to try and help. God, that must taste disgusting. Oh, we found a shrooms bag. Ignore all of the armor. Shrooms bag it is. We're taking that. Let's see what this helmet looks like. Hmm... You know what? We're going to switch it up. We're going to go for this other helmet. Some painkillers. Hell yes, we'll take those later. Ooh, some more canned food. Uh, let's open the canned corned beef for now. I know I need to take food with me, but we're really at risk of getting over encumbered here. All right, let's push on next door. Oh, that got their attention. Come on, jump on out. 
Ooh, another Louisville map. We'll take that. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, okay. You lot just come out here with me, please. Oh, a big hiking bag. Perfect. Let's put that on our back. It's typical. We need a backpack for ages, and then we find two at the same time. You know what? I think I'm going to treat myself to that watermelon from earlier. Let's eat all of this immediately. Okay, we just ate seven slices of watermelon. Damn. Uh, there's an engin engineer magazine. We'll take that now as well. Okay, not really seeing too much of anything else, but overall, pretty successful little loot, this. Just thinking, it's been a short while since we've had any drugs, so let's have another bag of cocaine. You know, just treat ourselves. Oh, perfect timing as we are now gonna have to fight some zombies come on mo show us what you got okay mo you are still pretty useless i'm afraid even with a bag of cocaine in you any more drugs nope okay another watch we can disassemble maria's boots what are they i mean we're gonna wear them because apparently they're really good but i've never seen them before damn they stick out Ooh, there's a little david the gnome over here i might go and grab him later kidnap him Ooh, Let's have some processed cheese for dinner. Why not? You know what? All this strawberry milk as well. I love how there's just like a meal left here and I'm like, no, I'll eat the cheese and the milk. Nothing else. Oh, for fuck's sake. Where do you come from? Oh, for fuck's sake. I can't get a moment's rest. Now, I was thinking of sleeping in this house. So let me just grab your corpse and we're going to dump this outside. You know what? I'm going to have another slice of watermelon as well. Why not? I think before bed, I'm going to sit down and take a read of the engineer magazine that we found. I'm starting to think that maybe, you know, once we're a little bit better, our little drug addict should go and explore Louisville. Will we make it that long? Um, knowing my rate, probably not. <laughs> have some more watermelon. Let's just wait for the uh, Midnight Life and Living show to come on, see if we get anything from it. Okay. So that was just the TV commercial that was completely pointless staying up for. So let's just go straight to bed. Okay, we're not tired enough. That's not good. I'll tell you what I am going to do then. Whilst we're, uh, we're still wide awake, I think I'm going to quickly drop this backpack. And you know what this means? We're going to do a little bit of exercise. So we'll do a quick hour of burpees before we go to bed tonight. Or at least attempt to do an hour. We'll have to see with those fitness stats. Hell yeah, we have gone up to strength level one. So that was worth it after all. Still not tired enough. Oh God. That might have been all of the cocaine that I had. I know what we can take. Now, we did find this earlier, which is a Xanax. Let's take a Xanax. God, it must be unbearable doing a workout in that full outfit. Okay, we've taken a Xanax. That should chill us out a little bit. Okay, are we ready for bed now? Still not ready for bed. I mean, do I have any more Xanax? God, I'm really not a good role model on this channel, am I? <laughs> I don't really know what to do. Okay, I'm just going to make him do some squats. God, look at the knees trembling. My word. <laughs> we are a pathetic man. Right, it is three o'clock in the morning. We are battered. Surely you are ready to sleep, man. Yes, finally. And we wake up bang on in time for the cooking show. That is perfect. Will this finally get us up to cooking level two? Nope. Not quite, just off. All right, I think we're ready to push out and explore, but first we'll have this for breakfast. Oh my God, there is an RV here. Now, I have a bit of a phobia of getting in these because I tried to record a Zero to Hero before. Uh, hopped inside of one of these and there was, no joke, about 20 zombies inside of it, which killed me immediately. So I'm very scared to hop inside of one of those for videos now. Okay, we're thinking of pills whilst killing that zombie. Do we have any? Uh, yes, we do. So let's take some painkillers. Ooh, some more shrooms. We'll uh, bring those with us as well. Okay, there's an aiming book. We'll take this and another dance magazine as well. Lovely stuff. We'll also scoff down this Parmesan cheese and we'll take these canned sardines with us. Ooh, some vitamins. We can take these as well. Ooh, that's a lot of zombies down there. Um, now first, before then, do we take the risk inspecting this motorhome oh god i'm really nervous i can't lie okay it does seem to be locked so that's probably a good thing now oh god we've got to take on these zombies i'm really oh fuck not looking forward to that one at a time please oh shit that's not one at a time oh fuck oh fuck 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 god i feel like as soon as i kill some just more arrive immediately Oh my god, thank god. Okay, we've just discovered this. That would be nice to carry around on whatever car we choose to stick with. And we found another needle. What a result. Ooh, a rosewood map. We'll take that. Another needle? Hell yeah. God, I know it's bad to take use needles off a human being. I don't know how bad it is to take them off a zombie. I'm sure it can't be that bad. We'll be fine. Oh my god, there's loads of books here. We might have to rest here for a little bit. Oh, fuck off. 
Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay. Okay, we have now got a cold as well from being out in the rain so much. Oh, a Maldra map. We'll take this. Now get inside and rest. God, we have a nasty cold already. That really didn't take long. Let's eat this Kung Pao chicken quickly. God's sake, we can hear zombies outside. That's not good. Please don't break any of my windows, you absolute dick. Now, we do need to find somewhere to rest up because we are really unwell. All right, I think this house should do. Let's just sit down in front of this TV. Let's have some vitamins. This might help us. What we could really do with a tissue or something just to cover up all this sneezing. Right, um... Do you have any painkillers? Yeah, take a painkiller. Right, and you know what? Let's uh, let's strip off. Let's take all these wet clothes off. Okay, hopefully we can get to carpentry level two. I think after this, we just need to go to bed and rest. I don't want to die from a cold. Damn, we are up to 69 kg. Nice. Oh, we're just off carpentry level two. That's very frustrating. Okay, no, tell a lie. We've just hit carpentry level two. Hell yeah. All right, are we able to just go to bed and rest? Yeah, straight to bed, get some rest. Got a bit queasy, but we'd no longer have the cold. We are in severe pain though, so let's take another painkiller. All right, I think we're just gonna chill for the rest of today. We should really count ourselves lucky for not uh, being worse with that cold. All right, let's read the How to Make Sausages magazine and the Dance magazine quickly. You know what, we'll read Trapping Volume 1 as well. This is giving us a good chance to uh, catch the next Life and Living show as well, so I wonder what Dean's gonna teach us today. Okay, he's gonna teach us how to build a fire. Very nice. You know what? For pulling through all of this, I think I'm going to treat us to something. We're going to open up one of the bags of shrooms. Why not? There we go. We've worked hard. Let's take the shrooms. I like how they're just normal mushrooms in the game. <laughs> I hope I can't overdose on these. Uh, yeah, take another. Why not? Okay, I've just taken six lots of shrooms. Let's hope this doesn't backfire. My guy's going to be tripping balls after this. God, he looks like someone that takes magic mushrooms. <laughs> Look at that fit. God damn. Now that we're tripping, we're going to read a little bit more of our our trapping book. God, it is midnight and we're still reading the trapping book. We're only on page 185 out of 220. Let's see if we've got any food in the uh, in the house before we uh, go to bed. Ooh, some sliced beets. Let's have those. Okay, after watching a little bit of TV, I think we're ready to go to bed. And we're up at 3.30. Damn, that wasn't a long sleep. Now, let's put our clothes back on, unfortunately. Hey, I think I've still got a little bit more room in me. So let's see what more food we eat. I'm tempted to have the dead mouse. Uh, we'll have the vegetable soup instead, though. All right, Mo, let's see what the day has to offer. Oh, yes, finally, Mo. We have found some oven mitts, and apparently they're good protection, so we're going to wear those. Hell yeah, we just keep getting funkier. Oh, damn, that's a lot of food. Let's have this fried rice. Oh, my God, we found a shotgun and shells. Oh, my God. Oh, that's probably going to be the end of us at this rate. I think we're going to take this trailer over here with us, so I'm going to put the shotgun in there for now. You know what, I'm going to put a few of our things in here as well, just to really lighten the load. Put some of the drugs in there as well, why not? Gotta be a death trap putting your hand in here. You're either going to uh, touch a gun or you're going to touch some crack. Or the rusty needle, I should say. Oh my god, what is all of this? Right, drop the hiking bag, because I think we've just found something better. Oh my god, this is so much better than our uh, big hiking bag. Let's put this on. We found a new gas mask that we're going to wear as well. And some combat boots. Very nice. Okay, we... <laughs> oh my god, we're looking overpowered. Time to empty a bag again. I can't believe we found three bags in such quick succession that have all just been progressively better than the other. Oh, there is another cook show on, which we are missing right now. Let's try and be quick and see if we can catch that. We have just found a medical magazine. Oh, quickly drink all the milk. Do it for Markiplier. Please hurry up. 10 minutes into the cook show. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get out of here. Quickly to the cook show. We can catch 10 minutes of it. I'm so close to level two. Oh, you dicks. I just want to watch the fucking cook show. Oh, I've got a feeling that I've got to miss it now. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, we're finding out about the Nox event, but I don't care about that. I wanted to learn how to cook. God, I'm so close to level two. Wait, why is the news channel on? Oh, for God's sake. I didn't even have the right channel on anyway. Oh, fuck it. Well, we missed the cook show. I didn't even have the right channel on, so never mind. All right, I may as well check out that final house next door. Why not? I don't think there's going to be anything in it, but I'd be annoyed at myself for not checking and missing out on something. Hmm, yeah, seemingly nothing. 
Ooh, actually, bag of marshmallows. Damn, that looks like pretty much the entire neighborhood now. Right, I'm gonna make a sprint a little bit to the car, just so we can try and get our sprinting skill up a little bit, just a little bit. Though I'm not planning on keeping this car, I think I'm gonna attach the trailer to the back of it and take it over to that other car that we found. Okay, that's now attached. Oh shit, where did all of you lot come from? Let's get out of here. All right, we're gonna have to deal with you all. Oh no, our machete just broke. Okay, it's time to use the fists. I'll oh, put them up. Oh, I'm pretty sure there was tape in the trailer that was left down here. Let me have a look. Oh, we did find some meth on a zombie though. Kind of worth it. Yes, there is some duct tape. Grab that. Now, let's get taping up our machete. Oh, hold on. Let's take care of you. Okay, the machete is looking almost as good as new. Hell yeah. Right, I believe at the house from earlier, I left a jerry can. Let me go and check. Oh, hello. Where'd you come from? Oh, fuck. Where'd you all come from? Oh, I almost completely forgot. We need to take all of our drugs and put them in the car. I don't want to lose these. God, we run like an absolute gremlin. I'm going to put all of our drugs in there. Right, we're going to take the trailer off the back of this car. It might be worth us training our mechanics a little bit on this as well before we get rid of it. Okay, because we've read the mechanics book, I'm hoping we get a nice boost here to boost the skill. We, uh, we've got some skill from that. Not too much. Now... It is the carpentry show in a short while, so sit down, my man. Uh, start reading the auto-tuning magazine, and then we'll read the medical magazine. Got up to 108 kills already. Not too bad, no? Cool. All right, that's the carpentry show done. Now, it's time that we get some fuel put into the original car that we wanted to use. Right, we're going to siphon some gasoline from this van. I think as long as there's enough fuel in the van, I might leave fuel in the green car, just in case we want to come back to it later on. Oh, yeah, we've nearly got a full tank in this car now. Let's get it hitched up to our trailer. Okay, that's good to go. Now, there's something I would like to do, which I've said in these videos before, I've never done in a whole, I think, 370 or 380 hours of playing this game, and that is go fishing. So I want to do that straight away. Now, I have no clue how to actually fish, so this is going to be interesting. I think I should clear all of the local zombies as well before I uh, even think of fishing. God, there are a few up there. Please do not come over here and disturb my fishing. Okay, let's go fishing. This is officially my first ever fishing experience in the game. Let's see how it goes. How long does it take to normally catch something? <laughs> this kind of sucks. Okay, we have actually caught our first ever fish. Never actually been fishing in real life. When I was a kid, we used to go to the coast and we used to go crabbing. <laughs> not very exciting. You'd catch a crab and then you throw them back into the water. Okay, we found a pair of shoes. That's not very exciting. I think that's me done fishing for now, I can't lie. We fought, caught one fish and one pair of shoes. I'm kind of impressed that we caught a pair of shoes. I mean, that's quite good going. Right, I think we push back to one of the previous houses and we cook up that fish for dinner. I think I want to make a note of this, you know, really remember the time that we had here. There we go. Made a little note so we'll always remember this spot. God, we are getting a bit drowsy, so now is definitely the time to rest up and, uh, have a bit of a chilled out evening. Now oh, we'll pick our uh, pick our fancy with which house we fancy staying in. I want to go to one that has a TV at least. Oh, this one has a TV. It'll do. Right, let's cook up this uh, this first ever fish that I've caught. There we go, good sir. Put it on the highest heat because I don't know how to cook in real life. There we go, it's cooked. Let's eat it straight from the oven. Damn, that's a big fish. Let's take some light reading out the back of the car and then we'll uh, we'll just chill for the rest of the evening. Let's uh, try and finish trapping first. Okay, Dean, what are you going to teach us today? Okay, he's teaching us how to do some foraging. Very nice, Dean. Not quite enough to get us up to foraging level one, though. Pretty useless. Okay, we finished the trapping book, so we can drop that. We can now read the electrician book. I think that's enough reading. Let's go to bed. Okay, we slept in till 7.30 the next day. My god, that's a proper lion. Let's have a quick smoke to start the day. Now, we are on edge, so I think we need to take a painkiller. Sort of ease our nerves a little bit. Oh, that's done the trick. Now, we could do with some food. Um, I'm sure there's plenty of leftover food in these houses. However, I'm feeling a little bit more adventurous, and I want to go and explore more of the local area. Didn't take long for us to find some new houses, so let's immediately check out... This little one here. Ooh, there are zombies inside. Let's go say hello to them. Alright, let's go say hello to the zombie in here. Just the one. No big deal. Uh, let's read the engineer magazine quickly, just so we don't have to carry it. And we'll read uh, this dance magazine as well. Ooh, freedom gas mask. We'll take this. God, we just love to accessorize. Pineapple jello. Let's eat all of that immediately. Very nice. Oh, and some ice cream. Eat all of that immediately too. That'd be great for gaining weight. Oh, this is a lovely little house, this. Let's eat this cheese sandwich. Oh, shit. The locals have come to say hello. 
There is a revolver here, however, I am going to resist. I uh, don't think guns are a good idea at this point, unless it's a shotgun, then I can't resist the urge. Now, let's continue reading our electrician book. Hell yeah, another carpentry show. Let's hope this gets us really close to level three now. Uh, three quarters of the way there, I'd say. Not too bad. You know what? I think I might just finish off this book so we can drop it. Right, let's go see what that store across the road has to offer. Okay, that's not a door. There's the door. Okay, what you got in here? Oh, there's plenty of snacks in here. Okay, see all of this cheese. Nice. I'll have all the margarine as well. That's great for gaining weight. Oh, and there's plenty of ice cream too. That's what we like to see. Let's take some of the snacks for the road whilst we're here. How big are we looking now? 74 kg. God, we're getting there. We're gaining that weight. Oh, a drug pipe. About time. And some alcohol wipes and matches. We'll take those as well. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, how did you guys know that I was outside? Ooh, an ammo pouch. One of them's a soldier. Brilliant. We're going to wear your ammo pouch. We're also going to wear your dog tags as well. Pretend I was part of the army. God, we're doing pretty well for ourselves. Let's start by reading the first chapter of this book, which is the sprinting chapter. Okay, Dean is back. And what is he going to teach us? It should be for trapping. Now, because we've read the trapping book, we should get a very nice little boost out of this. Oh my God, we're all the way up to trapping level two. That shot up. Right, let's switch this over to the nimble chapter. I'm not going to start reading it now because it will take half a fucking day at this rate. Well, we've woken up at 20 to 4 the next day. However, in good news, this technically means we have made it to our seventh day so far. So an entire week into the challenge. Pretty good going. We're going to start the day by eating some cheese and having a cigarette. Whilst it's dark outside, I think we'll just have a uh, pretty chilled morning reading and watching the cook show. I think this should be our last day of catching all of the Life and Living programs. It's either today or tomorrow. I can't quite remember. Okay, we've learned another skill in cooking. That puts us up to cooking level two. Very nice. Okay, we're still reading and we're coming up to the next carpentry show. So we may as well stick around to watch that as well. Oh yeah, can we get up to carpentry level three? We're so close at the moment. Yep, that's carpentry level three. Very nice. I'm gonna have a quick Vienna sausage before we pop out. Treat ourselves. Oh, god damn it. Okay, let's try and avoid those zombies over there. Okay, what's this house got for us? Not really seeing a lot of anything. Oh, we're needing something to take the edge off. What do we have on us? We'll have to take some painkillers for now. That might cheer us up a little bit. Let's eat all of this dog food now to punish ourselves for being a dirty, dirty addict. Right, we don't really know much more of the area around us, so maybe we take the risk and venture down here? We have been noticed by a couple zombies. Okay, we've gone at one level in maintenance, nice. Not really too sure why bashing zombie skulls in improves your maintenance, but we'll take it. Okay, I can hear a zombie. There we go. Oh! I don't know what three zombies we're doing in the bathroom together. Oh, make that four zombies. Oh, God. Ooh. Okay, an auto-tuning book. We'll take this and another emotional intelligence book. Oh, my God, there is a lot of books. All right, let's just rest up here for a little bit. Ooh, there's another watermelon here. I guess we'll uh, slice this up and eat it straight away. Okay, we've eaten a whole seven slices of watermelon. Okay, so exposure survival will be on in 40 minutes. So I think I'm going to start reading Cooking Volume 2 whilst we wait for it. Okay, Dean, what are you going to teach us today? Okay, we've gone up to level one foraging. We are getting a bit tired, but I want to do a little bit more exploring before we uh, go to bed tonight. Do I take the risk and go next door? I'm not too sure. Ooh, a protein bar. We'll take that quickly. Let's also eat these Morio cookies. Right, I think this will do for tonight. I really don't want to push our luck with being tired. Okay, I think we're just going to sit down for the rest of tonight and do a little bit of reading. Well, we're up at 7.30. Not too bad. Now, because we have this melee weapon book, uh, this will be great for boosting all of our weapon skills. So, a bit of a boring day, but I think I'm going to spend all of the day reading as much as possible so we can get a nice boost in all of these. I think long blade would make sense to do next just because that's obviously the weapon we're using at the moment you know what change of scenery we're gonna go into the lounge just in case there's one more day of life and living let's continue reading okay we have got some tv on at 12 o'clock let's hope this is a carpentry show oh god i can hear the helicopter outside that's not good okay so turns out the tv did not have any more life and living shows let's turn that off immediately we don't want to attract any more zombies oh shit hello where did you two come from where did you three oh my god there's more out the front Oh shit, okay. This helicopter is getting the zombies' attention. That's not good. Shit, 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 okay. Oh fuck, where are you all coming from? 
Ooh, one zombie did have some bomb bombs on them. We'll eat those immediately. Fucking hate the helicopter. I'm just hoping a zombie didn't break its way into the bedroom. Okay, no, I think we're fine in here. Let's just sit down on the ground and we will continue reading our melee book. Okay, we have just heard another smash that could potentially be in our house. Okay, as a reward for reading the next chapter of that book, I'm going to give him another painkiller. Let's go for the long blunt chapter and we'll read this next. God, we're really taking the time to get through this melee book. Come on, finish the book and we'll take the risk to get some food. I don't see any zombies out here just yet. Some mixed vegetables, I'm just gonna have to eat those immediately. I don't really want to cook because I feel like that will get the attention of the zombies. Grab the canned spaghetti bolognese. Oh fuck, hello guys. Oh fuck, oh fuck, get up, get up, get up. Okay, okay, okay. Don't panic. No, 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 don't panic. Okay, we're not panicking. Okay, we're just gonna jump this. We are gonna run round to our car and we are going to flee the scene. That is exactly what we're gonna do. Okay, right, off we go. Please don't hit the tree straight away. Oh God, oh God, this did not go to plan. Ooh, little clown zombie. I think we just head back to where we were originally and hope that we've wiped out enough of the local zombies. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of zombies around here. That's not good. Um, I think we need to find somewhere new to go. All the zombies are back around in this area. Fantastic. Right, you've been lovely. Whatever area this is, I think it's Valley Station. Let's uh, skedaddle. Oh my God, there is a fair few zombies now. Oh, we killed the clown zombie. Okay, I was going to pull in there and see if it was free, but... Apparently not. Right, we're crossing the train tracks. We're completely fleeing this area now. What is this? I don't normally spawn in this location. I think it might be a nursery. Uh, I'm pretty sure I did spawn here once before with a character. I think we're going to head south. I think that's the safest bet. Let's not head any closer towards Louisville. I feel like we might have to take the risk and sleep in our car tonight. I don't know how stupid of an idea that is, but it might have to be done. You know what? Let's try it. Okay, there's a zombie immediately outside our car. Let's just drive away. I don't want to get out of the car and find out there's more of them. So let's just decide where we're going to rest up now. Uh, you know what? Let's explore down here. What's this place got to offer? Apparently a lot more zombies. Okay. I'm really not familiar with this area. Is this like a little drag racing track? Oh my god, it is. Oh, okay. 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 We have to check out these cars. Oh my god. What a little spot this is. Let's check out these two cars. These look awesome. Is it a, is it a Pontiac Firebird? I used to be really into my cars as a kid. Not really so much anymore. But uh, I'm pretty sure that is a Pontiac. Okay, this one's open. Oh, no key though, okay. Someone did say in the comments you can potentially forage for keys, so let me see if that actually works. Yeah, I'll be honest, I don't think this is working. Okay, let's take care of this zombie over here, just so he doesn't sneak up on us. Oh, okay, there is a key. Okay, I think this is gonna have to be our new car. Oh, and it's in great condition. Yep, okay, we're upgrading. Now, let me check. Do we have any food in the back of here? I think we do. We've got plenty of drugs, but uh, it's not looking like much food at all. There's some canned sardines. I'll have to do for now. Siphon some gasoline from this. Put some fuel in here. I don't think I should take all of the fuel out of that car. I think it's good to leave some in it behind, just in case I ever find myself in the area and I uh, need to use my old car. Right, I think that'll do. I'll leave the rest of the fuel in there. Let's actually actually run over to this car here and I'll siphon the rest of the fuel out of this. Okay, it's looking like this actually has no fuel in it whatsoever. Never mind. I'd like to make a quick note that we left the car here just in case we do choose to come back to it. Okay, we all know I'm going to end up damaging this current car, so I've left a little note on the map to let me know that this car is still here with some fuel in it. Right, now feels like best opportunity for me to practice my mechanic skills. So I think I'm gonna practice on all three of these cars. Right, trainer mechanics on this. Again, I know there's another one of these over here somewhere, which could have a key, but I think we may as well stick to the Pontiac. Okay, we've milked that car for as much skill as we possibly can. Let's uh, do a bit of work on our uh, Pontiac. Oh, we've gone up one level of light footed. Okay, and we've gone up one level in sneaking. Oh, fuck. Okay, where did you come from? I do like that jacket, but I feel like it won't be better than what we've currently got. Better for scratch defense, to be fair. You know what? Let's do it. Not like we're going to get shot or anything. Let's also lob our other jacket in the back of the car for now. I think we've done enough messing around with the cars for now, so let's quickly check out these last few vehicles around here. I'm hoping we should get some really good supplies out of these two here. Oh, God, this one's locked. Nothing good in there. Oh, and we need some more pills. Will vitamins do the trick? I don't want to use up all of the painkillers. Uh, I'm tempted to take the speed, but considering the time at night, that might be a bad idea. I do actually want to sleep tonight. Ooh, okay, we found two car keys. Very nice. I don't know why the two keys are on the same zombie, but we'll take it. Okay, you need more drugs. I don't think that the vitamins did anything, so I'll give you another painkiller. Just don't blame me when you're in pain later and we don't have any left. Got some more painkillers. We're definitely going to need those of how quickly we're going through them. 
And there's a trauma bag, but with nothing in it. That's kind of useless. I do really like this car. And there's no key for it anyway. Nothing in it, though. It's kind of useless. Let's see if we can find anything cool in here. There's some more duct tape. I guess we'll take that. Yeah, not really anything of use here. I think we are going to have to spend another night in the car. However, we're in this car. I don't imagine this being as spacious and comfortable as our old car. Uh, before bed, I think we're going to read a bit more of Cooking Volume 2. Right, it's midnight, so let's go straight to bed. Okay, we're up at 8 o'clock in the morning. We slept pretty well last night. Our mission today really should be to get some food, so we should leave here as soon as possible. This car is definitely going to be a lot louder than a previous one, so that could end up being a problem. And it is a lot quicker, which means I'm definitely going to end up crashing. Oh shit, literally seconds later. Oh my god. This car's kind of hard to control with the big thing on the back. Ah shit, we're gonna have to go on the rail tracks. Okay, that was pretty smooth sailing. Ooh, we are at West Point now. I think maybe we should stick around here for a little bit. I love how I've just got a new car and my immediate reaction is to go and check out the other local cars. Ooh, that is a Gigamart. I feel like I probably shouldn't be lingering around here too much. Oh fuck yeah, okay. Let's not pick a fight with all of those. Let's try and find a little bit of a secure included spot. Okay, what if I go up here? Okay, there's more cool stuff, but I just don't want to get out and fight this many zombies. Oh, do we take the risk? I kind of want to. God, we are getting really hungry. We do need to sort that out. Fucking hell, this is going to be tough to find a spot. I'm feeling stupid, as usual. Let's go out and pick a fight with way too many zombies. Okay, as soon as I did that, our machete broke. Okay, right, this was a terrible idea. Let's just run straight back to the car. Okay, I am not ready to take this many zombies on after all. I literally hit one zombie once and my machete broke. So let's get out of here. Oh my God, I've made things so much worse. There's now more zombies here than ever. Oh, there's a little church there. Might go and burn that down later. Oh, that is a survivor house. Okay, we've got to take a risk. We have to take a risk. Right, can we get in here? Oh, fuck, hello. Do I take the risk? Yep. Okay, okay, okay. There's plenty of food. Quickly, eat the tomato paste because we're overly encumbered. Okay, take care of you next. Another fanny pack we can take. Okay, put that on our back. Okay, how many zombies are in here? Hopefully not too many. Right, killing zombies will have to take a break. We're still peckish. Eat the wild garlic bread. Eat all of it immediately. Okay, now that we're full, we can take care of the zombies. God, I think there's going to be more than one zombie in here. Okay, no, there is just the one. God, there better be some good loot in here. Oh, I'm not really finding anything so far. Oh my God, yes, it was all worth it. Plenty of drugs. Okay, I can see what kind of survivors these people were. They were party animals. I like to think that it was the drugs that killed them and not the actual uh, <laughs> uh, zombies. We've still got a while till they break through, so let's just keep looting. Oh, a bush machete. Yes, please. Plenty of canned food. We'll eat more of this garlic bread as well. Oh my God, what the hell is this? Another machete. I don't even know what that is, but we're taking it. Okay, we have found a beautiful amount of weapons. Wait, have they just broken the window and then fucked off? <laughs> okay, they're coming now. Shit, I shouldn't have made fun of them. Oh, there is an axe as well. Do we take it? Yeah. Oh my god, we have got some amazing loot out of that. Let's get back in the car. Let's not push our luck and let's just keep going. Oh my god, there's a school bus over there. Oh, fuck it. Fuck it. I'm probably going to regret this. Why not? Bring it on. Have I got some time just to lob some of our new weapons in the back? Let's try and put the axe in. Come on. No, okay. Okay, that was stupid. I shouldn't have bothered. I'm not quite as weak and pathetic as I thought I was. That's good news. Right, now, let's hope it was actually worth stopping because I know, we, again, we've just got this car, but I would love to have the bus just to be great to live in it and do a bit of a nomad adventure. Okay, whatever this is, I'm now going to use it as our main weapon for now. Okay, I... Oh my god, this weapon looks ridiculous. Why do I feel like that's going to tire me out to use, though? Jesus Christ, it's huge. That is definitely what she said. Oh, fuck. Okay, that is a... Oh. <laughs> Maybe we're uh, going to hold off on this weapon for now. I will use it, but I think we'll stick to the machetes for now. I think it makes more sense to use this once we're a bit stronger. I think I will use one of our new machetes for now, though. Check out this house. Hope that no zombies are inside. And then we'll check out the school bus afterwards. Ooh, oh, there's a gun case, but nothing in it. Mm. We'll help ourselves to uh, all of this chicken broth. Ooh, there is tequila as well. May as well take that. Be rude not to. Ooh, some chocolate. Let's eat that too. There's some bleach. I mean, I'm tempted, but we're not quite at that point yet. Uh, none of this is really jumping out at me. Ooh, books and booze though. That's jumping out at me. Let's quickly read this metalworking magazine so we can drop it. Tell you what, we'll eat these chips and we'll treat ourselves to a beer as well. We've earned it. Part of me is tempted to rest here for the night. I think I might. Alright, you know what? 
We're going to play it safe. For the rest of the night, we're going to sit on the ground. We're going to read this metalworking magazine. We're then going to eat this zucchini. And then we're going to read our cooking book. Very nice. We've read those very quickly. Let's quickly have some dinner before we go to bed. Let's drink all of this strawberry milk. And you know what? For all our hard work, I'm going to treat him to some oxy. Let's take this immediately. Oh my god, we're on the verge of passing out now. Right, straight off to bed we go. God, we're massively on edge today as we wake up. So we're going to start the day, I think, with a beta blocker. We are up to a whopping 87 kg now. Wow, we've actually done well for gaining weight. What do we do on this fine morning we find ourselves in? God, we did go on a little bit of a drive through the center, so I'm hoping the zombies aren't going to be too crazy around here, but we'll see. Let's eat these tingles for breakfast. You know what? We'll eat all of the fruit jam as well. What does today have for us? Oh, fuck. Hello. Good morning, all. I'm just going to ignore all of you. Okay, but you're not going to ignore me. I'm going to have to take you on. Oh, fuck. I'm going to have to take you on first. Oh, good morning. How are we? I don't really know what to do with myself this morning. I think maybe we keep heading north. I think if we stick to the rural parts for now, I don't really want to take on too many zombies at once. Okay, ultimately that was kind of pointless because I've probably just caught the attention of a load of zombies now by driving the car. Okay, we are getting a lot better with this machete. Oh, hello. Yep, yeah, we have got a fair few zombies coming for us now. Now, anything good in here? Oh, yes, there's alcohol on the floor. I will take that. Ooh, some bourbon. We'll take this. You know what? I'll fill up our water bottle in the toilet as well. Okay, I think he's gone for the shower instead. Right, I think we slowly edge back around towards the center, house by house. Oh my god, the car is really struggling on the grass. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Okay, we got this. Oh, I hope we've got this. <laughs> okay, I think we've got this. Oh, fuck. Okay, we actually did pretty well. Oh, I'm starting to think we may need to change out this car. It's a little bit too loud. All right, come here. And now, now that the area seems to have cleared out a little bit. Oh, actually, no, we'll go take care of those zombies. Then we're going to check out these two houses. Oh, there is a zombie in that house. Oh, hello, there's more around here. Right, I think we need to get some dinner down. Let's, let's have these pickles. Ooh, a farming magazine. Take that. Ooh, an aluminum... Ah, oh, the baseball bat's not in good condition. Otherwise, I would take that. Uh, there, are, there is a rifle. However, I don't like them. But I will take the ammo in case we find an M14. Peanut butter cups. Have that. Lovely. Some more painkillers. We'll immediately take one of those. Ooh, some processed cheese. We'll eat that. And we'll have the salami as well. Lovely stuff. You know what? We'll disassemble this radio as well. Ooh, before the pipelines magazine. I'll happily take that. And... I'm now we're gonna have to take care of this zombie. Ooh, another electronics uh, magazine. You know what? I think I'm gonna read this straight away. You know what? We'll read both the magazines that we've got just so we can get them out of the way. Another baseball bat, but again, it's in horrible condition. Nice little crowbar here. We'll take that. Right, I'm thinking we stick the crowbar in the car for now. You know what? It's been a while. I think I'm going to treat us to a bag of cocaine. You burnt it, champ. Okay, it would be kind of cool to check out the graveyard, but I don't imagine there being anything useful there. Instead, I think we're just going to push on to these local houses. Hello, gang. How are we? Ooh, it's a lovely little home. Okay, it does have an occupant, though. This is my home now. Oh, there is another one, so it's not quite my home just yet. Oh, uh, hello. Ooh, some more antidepressants and some more painkillers. Lovely stuff. Oh my god, there's loads of stuff here. Another empty gun case. God, that's frustrating. Ooh, this kid's room has a magnum in the <laughs> drawers. Jesus Christ, standard American household, right? I mean, we're not really finding anything too crazy here. I guess we could do with eating something. So we'll have these pickles and the zucchini. Hmm, anything in here? Nope. Hmm, not seeing an entrance into the garage. I mean, we do have the crowbar we could break it open with, but I feel like we're just going to get heavily encumbered doing that. Hello, neighbours. How are are we? Oh, damn, there's a lot more zombies around here. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't pick a fight with that many. Okay, what is this down here? Is this a school, a petrol station? Again, I'm not too familiar with the area. Oh, that's a wall and it's very full. Okay, maybe we head up this way. God, it is very busy around here. I'd really like to pick up a gun, I think. Oh god, I really- Oh my god, I really need to be careful. Oh fuck, okay, maybe I'm not gonna stop here. God, I'm sweating a lot. Uh, if I'm honest, I don't really know if I want to stay in this area. It seems like there isn't really a lot to raid apart from the houses. And the zombie count is just really excessive. Oh, I could do with some fuel, to be fair. Anything of use here for me? Oh, there is a bank. I mean, I would quite 
quite like to rob the bank. That would be quite a flex. Oh, and there is a police station. Ah, oh, do we take the risk? Am I going to regret this? Most definitely. Oh, shit. I'm definitely going to regret this. Oh, fuck a duck. Okay. 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 This was a terrible decision. Ooh, look at you and your bomb armor. Very cool. Very snazzy. I want to make it my mission this video to not die from zombies and instead die from a drug overdose. Gotta be careful not to corner myself here. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, I'm already getting exerted. I'm backing out of this idea immediately. Right, we need to calm ourselves down. What can we take? Oh, a bag of cocaine. That'll do the trick. Okay, we're no longer exerted after that, but we are very thirsty. Okay, okay. I love how instead of backing away, I'm like, yes, let me do some cocaine and then continue fighting. Yeah, whenever we're slightly exerted, we're just useless fighting them. So let's have another bag of cocaine. Uh, we are highly encumbered now as well. Do we have any food on us? Yeah, let's eat this chocolate bar. God, we're really thirsty. Shit, in fact, we're dying of thirst. Fuck. Okay, right, yeah, sprint back to the car, mate. This was a terrible decision. We need to get a drink immediately. Uh, oh, we do have an aqua bottle on us. Let's just put that on our possession. We are drenched with sweat. Okay, let's just back out of this then. Well, we killed a few. Not many, but a few. I'm making a executive decision and I'm getting us the hell out of this area. We are not ready for this. Oh, it'd be lovely to get some fuel, but it's just not worth it. Yep, we're getting out of here. I'm not staying around here. Okay, how do I actually get out of here? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, we're gonna go back this way. Oh god, yeah, I forgot about that bridge. Okay, where do we want to go now then? You know what would make the most sense? Rosewood. Rosewood would make the most sense, but it is a good good trek away. Oh, fuck it. It might have to be done. I might have to do it. Oh, shit. I've taken us back here. This was a complete accident. I guess uh, south again. Not that I want to go this way. I guess if I go north, we could go to Riverside. Oh, it's gonna have to be done. God, I can't make my mind up. I'm stressed. Wait, isn't this just going to take me back to where we started? Okay, I'm just an idiot. I'm such an idiot. Back we go again. God, I've really beaten up this car. It's not in good condition. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, be careful. Be careful. All right, hopefully this is the last time I'm going to have to cross this bridge. I just don't know where I'm going at all. Oh, no, our engine is really not good now. Well, there is a petrol station here, I guess. Oh, do we take the risk? I think we do need fuel. Oh, we're going to have to do it. All right, come here then. All right, come here. One at a time, please. Okay, that was easier than I thought. All right, let's go stick some fuel in the car. I mean, I should really be looking at switching, but uh, I don't, kinda don't want to for now. Hmm, I mean, a pickup truck would be useful. Uh, there's no key in it anyway. We will take the West Point map and this other Louisville map though as well. All right, refuel the car. God, I hope no one's getting attached to this car because I don't think it's gonna last much longer. Okay, she's nice and full. So let's go and check out the service station. Ooh, plenty of snacks. I might just take a few of these. We'll just take all these chocolates and things. Ooh, ice cream, okay. Let's eat a whole tub of ice cream. How thick are we looking now anyway? Oh damn, we are up to 89 kg. Maybe we don't need to go as crazy with uh, eating. Back on the road, I say. Okay, I am thinking Rosewood would be a good shout. You know what? The roads are looking fairly quiet. I'd say now is a good time to probably get some rest. God, we're up at half four in the morning. Um, right, on to Rosewood we go. Let's have some more food before we forget. Oh, we're starting to see more zombies now. Ooh, I think I know where we are. Okay, change of plan. We're not going to Rosewood. We're going here first. Oh, the bookstore. Okay, I will come back to you in a moment. First of all, I think I want to go to this little police station. Right. Right, we need some food. Uh, open the canned sardines. Bear with me, folks. Let me just have a quick snack. Okay, how many can we kill? Okay, this is going to be quite difficult. Come on, fall over. I didn't kill a single one. Oh my god, that's kind of embarrassing. This was a stupid decision. Okay, 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 okay. I didn't realise I was running into so many more. Uh, we're getting a tiny bit encumbered. It might be time for some cocaine in a moment. Uh, say in a moment. Let's take some immediately. Oh, fuck. Okay. And we're out of water. Shit. Okay. Okay, maybe I can lose them through here. Is that going to be worth it? We'll try. Okay, nope. Oh, there's not as many following us now. It's been a good little servant to us, but I think it's had its time. All right, come on.
Okay, I've now got a nasty cold. Um, as we're incredibly sweaty, uh, I think I need to take off my armor and stick it in the car. Now, oh God, we do look a state. Now, we are really unwell, so let's take a painkiller. Right, back to the car. We need to take care of these ones now. God, we put this thing through hell and it still starts first time. I need to find a tissue so I can equip it secondary. Oh, another Louisville map. Take that. Fill all the bottles. Okay, straight into the back. Oh my god. I don't even know where to begin. These SWAT guns. Oh my god, these are so good. Found some leg pouches. I mean, I'll wear those. Ooh, fingerless Kevlar gloves. We need those, so we'll take them. I mean, we'll take the shotgun shells. We'll take the SWAT gun and the 9mm rounds, as well as the MP5 magazine. I think now it's important that we find somewhere to rest. Ooh. Not before we take this acid with us. Okay, whilst the car's still got a little bit of life in it, I say we attach it to that trailer and we move up to, I'll say the petrol station maybe. Right, very quickly get these attached. Oh, hello. Uh, yeah, I don't want to make more, any more friends today. No, thank you. Oh shit, the car's starting to cut out. Not just yet, we need you a little bit longer, I'm afraid. No, oh, no, 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 don't. Don't cut out, don't cut out. Okay, I was going to go to the petrol station, but I've changed my mind. I know where else I want to go. God, there's so many zombies. Shit, okay, I didn't expect this. I can't lie. Right, very, very quickly, mate. Come on. I said very quickly, and that's not very quickly. This is how we're going to have to kill them. You know what, whilst we do this, we'll take another painkiller. And we'll have a vitamin as well, why not? Oh, please don't let there be much more than this. Oh, no, 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 no. The car is really not in good condition now. Come on. One or two more, please. I can't believe I bothered to fill this up with fuel. Right. Out, out, out. Oh, fuck. Please just go away. Okay. Oh, my God. We've actually made it through that. We'll loot all of the bodies tomorrow. Today, I just want to get in this house and relax. I swear to God, if we get in there and a fucking alarm goes off, I'm going to be so annoyed. Okay. I can hear more. Oh, fuck. There you are. Hello. No, fuck. Oh, I swear to God, that better not be bad. It's just a scratch. Okay. Disinfect it. I mean, I am taking the risk. I'm quite literally fighting them naked. Oh, okay. Right. Uh, we need a little pick me up. So let's have the speed. Take the pill. Okay. We're feeling much better after that. I think we might have to try and lose them in the forest, but I don't know if our sneezing is just going to attract them. You're going to have to try and follow me through here, I'm afraid. God, we already can't hear them. Let's just circle around. Maybe they've lost us. Ah, oh, we're getting exerted a little bit again. So I know you're not going to feel like this, mate. Your nose is going to be completely bunged up with snot. Oh, I was going to make him do some cocaine, but I think we're out. Never mind. Okay, some zombies have noticed us. They can hear that cough a mile away. I've never been more desperate to find a used tissue before. <laughs> Ooh, a drug pipe. We'll take that. Just need to go and get some rest. We are now getting sick as well. Oh, God. Okay, we are not in a good enough condition now. Where is that other bit of speed? We're going to need this. Take the pill. Come here. Come here, you fucker. Oh, of course, there's more zombies in there. Okay, I, I don't have time for this. Oh, please let there be a tissue in here. All right, we need to drop our bag. It's too heavy for us. All right, you know what? Can I just sleep? Oh, too much pain. Okay. Um, okay, I found the fanny pack with the cocaine. Take some more cocaine. Oh, fuck, hello. Why are we still so heavily encumbered? We're not carrying anything. Oh, you are joking. No. I can't believe we've actually died. We died from a fucking cold. I'm actually so shocked that's killed us. We died from a fucking cold. I think the cold was related to taking drugs, so in a way that did kill us. That was a very disappointing run. We only made it to 12 days and we killed 361 zombies. Ah, uh, well, I guess this will have to do. If you did enjoy this video, I would appreciate a like. You know, do subscribe if you want to see more. I think I'm going to take a little bit of a break from the Zero to Hero videos. I think I've really oversaturated YouTube with them. I've done too many. Uh, so I'm going to look to do a little bit of other Zomboid content. If there are other types of Zomboid videos you want me to try, do let me know down in the comments. And as always, I hope you have a great day. And thank you so much for watching. Take care.